The anticipation is mounting here as both sides get set for this matchup between the Seattle Seahawks and the Cincinnati Bengals here at Paul Brown Stadium. Back in your days when you had to take on a team from the AFC, didn't know them all that well. What was it like as we have this little interconference matchup today? Well, I thought back in those days, Jim, we were about ready to show them what toughness and hard hitting was. Uh, today it's a little different. But I'll tell you this, this NFC team, they are a hard-hitting bunch. Green Ellis is lined up as the single back. The give, trying the right side, picks up about eight. That was a nice run that time by the offense, picking up those yards. And any time you gain more than three yards on a running play in the National Football League, it is deemed successful. Second down and two to go after the running play. Charles is handed the football. It'll be third down. Of course, it's a three and out. Bill, we heard from the defense they wanted to get to the quarterback early and often, and they've gotten to him early. Well, they're off to a good start, no doubt about that. The offensive line, they got to know they're in for a long, tough battle today, and they better toughen up. Harvin will return the punt. Spins away from the tackle. First down here. That's enough for a first down. Good job by the quarterback that time. He doesn't panic. He reads that it's a zone, and you have to wait for the receivers to get in between the defenders. Nice throw and catch. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Hand off to the back, slashing to the right side. They bring him to the turf. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. On second and three, screen. Catch is made. Count it. Touchdown. Well, when your offense goes out there and scores a touchdown to put you ahead, it's got to give a big lift to the defense. they got to get excited and go out there and hold that lead. The point after try is in the books. Steven Hauschka ready for the kickoff. Good piece of tackling. First down, offense readying for the snap. They hand it off to the running back. And that's a big tackle behind the line of scrimmage. Got to give the defense some credit on first down. There's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. And he's taken down. Well, the quarterback's got to see this blitz when it's coming. And if he checks to an audible to get rid of the football quicker or give himself extra protection, that will help him a lot. The Bengals are at the line of scrimmage and loading up that line with an extra tight end. 
looking to the right side and throwing. Incomplete, almost intercepted. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third and long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. Kevin Huber being called on now for the punt. A little sloppy here, and the ball is muffed. That's a gain of eight. Well, that's nothing but just uh, that, that's just luck. That's all you can say. You're the return team, they fumble the football, it bounces out, and they get it back. They lucky there. On first down, the quarterback will hand it off, searching for space to the right. What a good job by the defensive player there, just flushing the running back and driving him into the ground. Set up screen, brings it into his body. A tackle behind the line. That was just a dumb call. When you throw it behind the line of scrimmage like that, you deserve to lose some yards. That's what happened on that play. Complete the pass, but still not enough for the first. Third down coming up. Golden Tate makes the catch. Plenty of zip on that throw. How do you stop these receivers now? It's almost impossible with the rules of the game. Uh, tight coverage. That time they have double coverage on him. It doesn't matter. The throw comes. They go up. They make the catch. All you can do is raise your arm and go, well, we did our best. Now first and ten. And Bontaz perfect from behind the line of scrimmage. Nice job that time by the defense getting the sack. The blitz was well-timed, and when it's well-timed, the offense doesn't have time to react, and they get a good sack. Russell Wilson has it under center. Intercepted by Reggie Nelson. They got him down there. That was an awesome job by the defense. They just read the quarterback's eyes. They got in position, and they made the interception. It's first down as they head to the line. The handoff running behind the tackle. And there's only two yards to be found right there. Good job of the defensive line standing in there and fighting, and they hold the running back to a short game. Second and eight. Here's the handoff, running off tackle. He'll be caught down, but not before picking up the first down. Nice run that time by the running back, and if they keep running the football like this, it's just a matter of time before they fake it and throw that football over the top of the defense. They are being physical, the running back doing a good job, and they are making it happen in the running game today. Coming up, second down. Running back gets it on the handoff. Going to be a tackle for a loss. Terrible call that time by the coach. The defense was expecting run. They were up there. They were aggressive, crowd the line of scrimmage, and you just, you just played right into their hands, and they got the tackle for the loss. 15 minutes down, 45 minutes to go. Back after this word from your local station. We're back here in this low-scoring affair. Kevin Huber being called on now for the punt. Harvin will return the punt. He's brought down. Well, the best thing we can say about that punt return, well, he didn't fumble the football. Got 
First and ten. As they go ground here, tackle down at the 46-yard line. That was a running play that time by the offense. It picked up some good yards. Nothing like it. Show the defense you're willing to get in there and slug it out and get some tough running yards. That time, the pass is completed into double coverage, Jim, but the quarterback made a bad read. But these receivers, they are so good nowadays. That time, in double coverage, he went up and made the catch. It's like Bill Parcell said to me once about Mark Bavaro, a very talented receiver. He goes, remember, Sims, when he's covered, he's open. First and ten. Percy Harvin with the grab. This doesn't look good. We've got a player down, and he's in pain. Always hard to guess what the injury is, but I don't like to speculate, but I think it's pretty apparent. It's an upper body injury. We'll let you know when we find out. First down and 10. Throws to the right. How did he drop that? Look the football in. With the gloves these receivers wear, the rules that you can't touch them, there's no excuse for dropping the football. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. Caught it, but his feet are out of bounds. Good job that time by the secondary. They're in good position. They make the play, and it's an incomplete pass by the quarterback. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. Third and ten. Just had to avoid the sack. Incomplete. The Seahawks getting set to attempt the field goal. Oh, it's a fake. Looking across the middle, the interception. Most NFL linebackers are borderline good enough to be a running back, and they got the hands of defensive backs. Here's a good case. What a fine catch on the interception by the linebacker. First down coming up. Here's the handoff and no run. Oh, we've got an injured player on the field. Well, that looks like an upper body injury, Jim. I think we both can tell that. And uh, now the question is, how bad is it? Uh, you just never know. Gresham's usually a tight end, but he's in the backfield this time. Dalton's got it in the gun. And they sacked the quarterback. I don't know what the quarterback was looking at. He had to know the defense was blitzing that time. Doesn't make a quick enough decision, and the defense gets there and gets the sack. Split backfield here. Dalton's going to take the snap from the shotgun. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long, they can do just about anything, and it's going to work, and they stop the offense that time. Well, we're anxious to hear the full story on that injury. Let's go down to Danielle Bellini with the story. Guys, I had a chance to speak with a Bengals team official. The injury appears to be minor, so the trainers are just looking him over one last time, and then he'll get back on the field. Come to the line, and it's first down. We'll go ground to the right side. Gains 11. Nothing like seeing a complete offense. That's what we're watching here today. Yes, we know they can throw it, but what they're showing us here, they can grind out some first downs running the football, too. 
challenging the defenders to the right side. Quarterbacks love play action passes because the defense, sometimes they're expecting run. You fake it, easy completion down the field. First down here after the completion. They'll run it. Here's the handoff. Now cutting to the right side, looking for some open space. It's now second down and seven after the three-yard rush. Wilson's going to take it from the gun. In zone bound, and he's got the touchdown. What a tough throw and catch into a tight spot right there for the touchdown. But in today's game, these players are so good that you have to throw it in traffic. They've got to make the catch. That time he did. The Bengals are ready to return the kick. out of the tackle and he's going to be taken down well short of the 20 let's mark him at the 15 Andy Dalton will be under center first and 10 play action goes deep to AJ Green that ball is picked off Give a lot of credit to the defense this time. They got the offense backed up. It's inside its own 20. They're aggressive, and being aggressive gives them a chance to get the interception, and they make it. Nice play. First down all the way. Throwing now to his left. Reggie Nelson makes the tackle. Sometimes they tell the receiver just to go long, run a fly route, run a nine route, because that means straight ahead or a streak. Show the speed that you have and get it done. First and 10, throws the pass. Russell Wilson out to Sidney Rice. Jim Nance, that was the old fly route. When we were kids, that's what they called it. See if you can fly by the defensive back. He did that time. Nice throw and catch. They're setting up screen. They deck him in the backfield. When you make play calls like that, you're not going to win many football games. That was a terrible call here on first down. Two-minute warning. This will be second down. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Throws it in the end zone. Touchdown. What a tremendous throw by the quarterback that time for the touchdown. What confidence he has in that arm. Small window. Very little room to throw that football in there. He didn't worry about it. Fired it. Got the touchdown. Steven Hauschka ready for the kickoff. And they're all over him at the 18-yard line. Gresham's a tight end, but lined up in the backfield for this play. Under fire on that throw. Second down coming up. Into the open flat. Secures it with two hands. He's got some daylight. And that's a touchdown, and they inch closer. This guy can do it any way you want it. He can throw when nobody's around him. He can throw when they're close to him. But how about that play? Takes the hit, but still able to put the football on the money for the touchdown. Bengals ready for action. He's a dangerous returner, and he'll have a chance to show you right here. Spins out of the tackle. Hey, hey, hey. 
Tate's lined up now as a slot receiver. First and 10 to the ground here. Going to lose yards here. Now the play is there to be made, but the offensive player doesn't get it done. Bad job on first down. After running it, it's second down. And he's thrown to the ground. This defense, they are definitely not faint of heart, are they, Jim? They will bring the pressure. Good blitz that time, and they take the quarterback down. Quarters formation here for the defense. Looking to the right side and throwing. With two hands, he has it. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Throws to the right. And intercepted. Tackles made. What a terrible job by the quarterback. Nobody's open. Tries to force the pass and look. What's it turn into an interception? Andy Dalton will be under center. First and 10. Hand off. In the end, it picks up only a yard. Good coaching on the defensive side. Everybody stays at home. They stay in their gap, and they hold that run to a short game. Almost intercepted that time. A lot of athleticism on display right there. Two battling for the football, and no one able to come away with it. You said it right, to two tremendous athletes, but a good job by the defense that time. They won out. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. That catch gives them a first down. And he's brought to the ground. Find a way to score. That's always the mantra with every team when they get in the red zone. If you punch it in here, even though you're down by more than seven, it'll give you confidence for the rest of the game. Back to the air here on first down. Touchdown. That'll close the gap. Now that was a terrific job getting that touchdown there. And what you've done, you've closed the gap. Keep chipping away at that lead. Make the opponent keep playing. See if he gets tight. It's tight. Got a better chance. They face first down. He'll fire it out to the left. Has the reception all alone. The Seahawks signal for the timeout. And that's the first one they've used. They've got a first down now after that catch. Wilson's back in shotgun formation. And he makes the catch. It's one thing to be able to throw the football that high and far, but it's another. He found the right receiver to throw to and put it right on the mark. That long gain sets them up here on this play. He's looking to the right. He puts up six. Nice job running that fade down the field. Nice throw by the quarterback, and we get a touchdown. The Seahawks now lined up for the extra point. Oh, it's a fake. They will not find a way into the end zone, so they'll only get six points out of the trip. Seahawks ready here for the kickoff. Tackle just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. Two tight ends on the field here. Dalton's play action. Intercepted. 
that brings the play to an end. That interception is strictly on the quarterback. When you make bad decisions, I don't care how good you can throw the football. The results, usually it's going to turn into an interception. Quarters formation here for the defense. First and ten. Now makes the move to the right. And he's going to pitch it here. He is brought down at the 49-yard line. So that's going to do it here for the first half. Seahawks are up here in this one. We're back here now in this one, where the Seahawks lead by 13. A check to the sidelines with Danielle Bellini reporting. I had a chance to quickly speak with Russell Wilson during halftime. So far, his team is out in front, and he told me the important thing now is playing smart. If they can control play and just avoid costly mistakes, they'll be in good shape in the second half. That's all from down here, guys. Back to you. Danielle, thank you very much. Now we'll go to the field. The second half gets rolling now as he takes the snap. And they can't connect. Well, they go for the bomb, but the defensive backfield was not fooled. Yeah, they were all over at that time, and they just, that was like shadow defense. Wherever the receiver was going, the defense was right next to him. Great job. Second down following that incompletion. Miller's going to pull in the bullet pass. How about that? We just saw the fly route straight down the field by the wide receiver. Long throw by the quarterback and a nice completion. We'll use a timeout here early in the second half. That was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. There's a receiver there, and the catch is made. It takes really good corners to play a defense where you challenge the wide receivers and just play them man-to-man -man coverage. I don't think this defense has that kind of quality corners. First down, following the long play. Incomplete. Kent, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. You're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. Failing to complete that one. So, second down here. Trying to work that left side. In the books. Touchdown. Something you always got to be alert for nowadays in the NFL. The fade route. The defense caught off guard just a little bit. Nice throw. Nice touchdown. The point after is good. The Bengals are ready to return the kick. Able to move past the 20 and brought down at the 23. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Here's the running play. Off tackle. Well, that was a nice run that time. Off tackle. And listen, this is a bread and butter play in the NFL. It's about power running. Can your offensive tackle make the block to free up that running back so he has a chance to get in that secondary and make a nice run out of it? He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. That'll stop the play right there. When you pick up first downs against the defense, they will get tired. That time, nice job by the offense getting the first down, even though they're losing here in the game.
The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. And it's incomplete. Just couldn't hold on to it after the hit. You might as well catch it because you're going to take the big hit no matter what. That time, the receiver lets the ball go because he was worried about the defender making the hit. That leads us to second down. The give to the running back. That's a tackle at the 48. Good job by the defensive player squaring up that running back and just putting his big butt right into the ground. Now third and four following the run. Setting up screen. He makes the catch. And he's going to be tackled. And that's going to bring us to fourth down. This defense you're playing against, they're pretty good. So it's fourth down near midfield. Punt the football. This is going to set up a change of possession. Well, that's four plays and out for the offense, and that was bad. Bad play calling, bad play, bad execution. Go to the bench and try to rethink what you're doing. Russell Wilson has it under center. First and ten. Challenging the defenders to the right side. The Seahawks get a first down. The quarterbacks and receivers in this NFL now are so good. It's so easy for them to throw and catch and just keep picking up those first downs. That reception gave them the first down. First down, throwing again. Going to be a penalty here. Defender got caught in the neutral zone right there. That'll cost him five. Yeah, he's a little too anxious. You know, all these defenders, they got one thing in common. You know what that is? They hate quarterbacks. They want to get there. A little too nervous there. Gets him caught in the neutral zone. It'll be first and five. The defense gets a sack. Well, if your offensive line's not good enough just to stop the pass rush, then you got to help them out. How do you do that? Well, you keep the tight end in, let him be an extra blocker, and you tell your running backs to help out, too, blocking some of these defensive linemen. He'll throw it over the middle. He fires it in there tight. When you talk about throwing the football into open space, that's almost always against zone defenses. That's what we saw that time. Good job by the quarterback throwing it in there. Third and two. Going across the middle. Gains nine. The defense has got to be a little aggressive here. Your team is down. You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. What a hit, and the ball is dropped. Well, it's so hard to do this nowadays to jar the football out of the hands of the receiver, but the defender did it that time. He hit him. That football came loose. Incomplete pass. Second down after the incompletion. Gains 12. Good play call that time by the offensive coordinator. Down inside, when you're inside that 20-yard line or the red zone, find ways to complete the pass. They did that time. First down here after the completion. They give it to the running back. Someone's been injured out there. Hold on a minute. I think you can just tell by the body language and the way he's acting. That is an upper body injury. Hope it's not severe. We'll let you know as soon as we find out. The defense is ready to plug up the middle here on the goal line. He had no time to get set. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. Defense ready in the goal line formation on this one. Third and goal from the three. Running it like it's a runs it across. Touchdown. Well, the defense knew that they were probably going to see a run here in third and goal. And what do they do? They don't, it doesn't matter. They still get blown off the line of scrimmage by the offensive line. Nice job. And the point after is good. Seahawks ready here for the kickoff. And he 
He's tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. Offense lines up here. First and 10. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Oh, and almost picked off that time. When you're going against a good quarterback and wide receiver in the NFL now, one of the ways to stop it is tight man-to-man -man coverage. You against him. Green Ellis is in the backfield on second and 10. That ball has been picked off. Nobody was going to catch him there. Touchdown. You got to love that from your defense. They take a chance. They get the interception. Not only do they do that, they return it a long way for the touchdown. Extra point was good. Steven Hauschka ready for the kickoff. Met head on right there at the 20. The Bengals come out in the pistol. First and 10. Ben Jarvis Green Ellis carries the ball, muscles through the defender. He's going to be tackled right around the 24-yard line. Good job that time by the offense. Power run gets him a few yards. It's now second down and seven after the three-yard rush. That wraps up the third quarter here in Cincinnati, and we'll be back in just a moment for the start of the fourth. The Bengals' offense tries to continue some momentum, still possessing the football as the final quarter gets underway. It's now second down. He'll take the snap, the first here in the fourth quarter. Right down Broadway. It's a touchdown. Well, it's a nice touchdown drive by the offense. They're still behind, but I got to say this to the defense. You're just giving up. You're letting them march down there and letting them get back in the game. Toughen up and get it done. The Bengals for the point after. Count it. The kicking team now getting set here for what looks like an onside kick. That kick came right at him, and it looks like the receiving team has recovered. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. Now first and ten. Out of completion this time. And he's out of bounds. Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. They're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. They've got a first down now after that catch. Looking across the middle, another touchdown to increase the lead. Nothing like having a quarterback who has a good arm who can, who can just fire that football into some tight spots. And then it helps when your receiver has got the talent and the courage to go in there and make that tough catch. Seahawks ready here for the kickoff. Tackles made right around the 26-yard line. Gresham's playing out of position in the backfield here. First and 10. 
throws the pass. That pass was hurried. Second down here. Dalton standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. Has the catch. He's in the clear. The 10, all the way home and all alone. Touchdown. When you're behind in the football game, drive down and score, they did that. Now the next time when they get back out there, they got to do it again. Show some patience and drive it down the field. It's good. They line up here for the onside kick. They want that football back. The receiving team has the recovery. First down here. He'll throw it over the middle. Makes the catch. Beautiful touch pass that time by the quarterback. He dropped it right in there. And this is a pass that every quarterback must have in his arsenal in the NFL. Second and 10. They're going to get him this time. When you're the quarterback and you see a blitz, you got to know you're going to drop back, look at a receiver, and let it go. No hesitation is allowed, he hesitates, and the defense gets the sack. Third and 13. And they sack him on third down, and they force the quick three and out. The offensive line did a terrible job that time, reacting to the blitz by the defense. They let the defenders come free, and they sack the quarterback. Comes to the line, ready to pounce on that quarterback one more time. Can they get another sack right here? Looking to the right side and throwing. Makes the grab. Nice job by the coach that time going forward on fourth down. His team is up here in the second half. He wants to keep momentum. on his side that's why he goes for it and they get it let's see how they back up the big play here throws to the right Ball is caught and gains about one. Well, I guess the best thing to say there, Jim, is they completed the pass, but it still did not get a first down. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Wilson from the shotgun. He's looking to the... He's intercepted. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled. Being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did, they got the interception. Now on first down, Andy Dalton in the shotgun formation. And almost picked off. That's what you have to do as a defensive back. you got to wait to the last second. Wait till the receiver uses his hands. And once they go up, put your hand in between them and knock that football down. What a play. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. Oh, almost caught. Just stick the football on him. When you see a receiver run around like this, they're going to the corner. 
drive it, throw it on the line drive, so that way there can't be a mistake. Following that incompletion, it sets up third and ten. Going across the middle, and incompletion right there, but it really should have been an interception. Let's just tell it like it is, Jim Nance. His receiver's not a very tough guy because he gets hit. It should have been a complete pass, but he gets hit. He just throws that football on the ground, and the pass is incomplete. Quarters formation here for the defense. Setting up a little screen. They fail to convert here on fourth down. Yeah, the crowd is always yelling. Their team is losing. Go for it. It's fourth down. Well, they went for it. Now, what do you say? They didn't get it. Bad call by the offense. They shouldn't have done it. First and ten. Eyeing that left side. Kick away. That's a wonderful job that time by the secondary. Everybody's in position. Nowhere for the quarterback to throw the football, and it leads to another incomplete pass. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. Second down and 10. They run right. The defense got to be a little aggressive here. Your team is down. You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. They're able to move the chains after that last run. He had it, but the hit jars the ball loose. Jim, that pass ends up incomplete because the defender, he just jarred the football loose with that hit. Nice job. Get that shoulder into the receiver, knock that football out, and get it to the ground. The defense comes out in the nickel. Second and ten. And he's going to be brought down. He's pressuring the quarterback. That's what you love to do in the NFL from the defensive side. That time, the blitz, it was quick, it was fast and they get a sack on the quarterback. Challenging the defenders to the right side. The margin is increased with another touchdown. How about this get? A wide open receiver down the field. The quarterback, good job of finding. He throws it down there and he gets the easy touchdown. Makes the PAT. The Bengals are ready to return the kick. They stop him from running it out to the 20. Mark him down at the 19. Two tight ends. First down and 10. Going off tackle here. He stacked up at that point. Well, I know it's not going to make a highlight film, but still a good solid run up in there for a couple of yards. Green Ellis is lined up behind his quarterback as the single back. They need to get the playoff. The defense gets the sack. When you talk about a blitz on the defensive side, it's all about timing. Disguise it to the last second and time up the snap of the football. They did it that time, and they get the sack on the QB. the two-minute warning. Andy Dalton will be under center. Looking for an open receiver on the right. The tackle is made, and that's a three-and-out series for the offense.
Green Ellis is lined up directly behind the quarterback here. Reaches out and grabs it. Swallowed up behind the line of scrimmage. This is what they call managing the game. The head coach decides to go for it on fourth down, and you just got to expect either way that you're going to make it, or if you don't make it, what are you going to do? First and ten. Looking to the right side and throwing. Oh, bad decision that time by the quarterback. He tries to force the football into the end zone and then almost gets picked off by the defense. Second down. From the gun. He'll fire it out to the left. McCoy's there with the sure hands to pull in the rocket pass. Well, Jim, what a day for this offense. You know, they're blowing the team out, and here they are once again in the red zone. I, hey, listen, if I was them, I'd go ahead and try to punch it in one more time. A tackle that had to be made. The battle set up fourth down. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. It's a failed conversion, but you might as well look at it like a turnover. It's going back the other way. The quarterback's been getting hit. He's been getting sacked a lot today, so you've got to change it up on the offensive side. Keep the tight end in. If you do that, that'll give the quarterback a little extra time to throw it. He's setting up here. He's been sacked five times today. Really been beat up. And the quarterback is taken down. Nice job that time by the defense getting the sack. The blitz was well-timed, and when it's well-timed, the offense doesn't have time to react, and they get a good sack. Dalton looking long. A takeaway. He's brought to a halt. Jim, this defense is just attacking today. They got the offense backed up. They go after them. They're aggressive. And what does it do for them? It gets them an interception inside the opponent's 20-yard line. Setting up in the pistol on this play. Heading right. Has the first down and a whole lot more. A lot of ways to get plays in the NFL. It doesn't always have to be by a pass. Good job that time by the running back lined up in the pistol formation. There's a yellow marker down on the field. He'll go left. Gains maybe five. Offside. Defense. Players from both sides making an appeal, but the officials down. saw it on the defense. That flag gives them a new set of downs. Looks to his left. No stopping him now. That's a touchdown. That touchdown might just wrap it up. Yeah, it sure will, Jim. It's been an exciting game all day, and it, uh, to score late in the game like this to put it away, it's time to celebrate a little on the sideline. Oh, he actually misses the point after. Steven Hauschka ready for the kickoff. No one's going to get him now. He's at the 50, the 40. He's got some daylight. The 20, the 10. a two-point safety for the defense. It was a one-sided matchup early, and this game is finally over. How much sweeter is practice going to be this week after the win on that sideline? Once you 